We got about an hour left of sunlight here in Texas. And I am here with you as your Planetary Defense Commander, Star Lord Newthor 7, on Easter, aka He is Risen, aka Resurrection Day 2022. And there's car destroying hail happening south of San Antonio right now. Hail has been crazy, man. Hell yeah. And the sun continues to go crazy active with the activity. We have another M-Class solar flare. So we've had an X-Class flare, an M16, and an M44 in the last 24 hours. This update brought to us by industrial engineer Irene Quiorres. Man, I hope they resurrect the space shuttle. Good news about the virus is good news. So celebrate. There's a cool thread on Twitter. And Twitter's been in the news lately. I don't know if you heard. But Joshua's like, hey, man, if you were Jesus, how would how would you have come out of the tomb like? Memes and gifts, videos, I guess, only. And this is a pretty cool thread. And I say that as a Norse Christian Jedi. So I hope everybody is having a great day. And um, someone said that like Orthodox Christians don't celebrate Easter till next Sunday. So I guess technically that makes it Easter week. And coincidentally, it'll be my eight year anniversary as your planetary defense commander. And to think that like at some point in my life, I was like, all right, I'm gonna spend the next eight years trying to help Earth get to a peaceful place of prosperity and avoid World War III and civilization collapse. I don't know, it seems like kind of an interesting choice to make, right? But today I'm filled with hope and optimism. And I hope you've had a great day and know that I appreciate you. And, and, and you'll let me make jokes like, hey, it's like the sun is flaring from the rooter to the tutor. Because this one had, had the X-class flare and then this one had the two M-class flares. And that's like a... All right. Okay. People are like, man, SNL is no, not funny anymore. And I'm like, hey, did you see the new Mayor of Game Town skit? That was one of the best written skits I've seen in a long time. It was hilarious. And Lizzo was great. And I'm grateful, you know, that I live in America and we do have freedom. And like right now, Shanghai is on getting another two weeks. And I think they've already had four weeks of lockdown. Like full-fledged, can't leave your place, lockdown. And they even got little robots running around saying, hey, been flying around, rolling around and like dog paddling around saying, hey, don't leave your house, don't sing, and don't talk about freedom. And that is like some of the weirdest, most dystopian shit I've seen in my eight year. I hope, I wish everybody peace. You know, it's like Ramadan, um, Passover, full moon, Easter. And then, you know, we live in interesting times. And it's day like 52, 53 of being on like World War Three, DEFCON, WTF. Oh my God, things are crazy. And over here on Twitter in the USA, they're dissecting the loss of the Russian flagship on Good Friday, which seems like a bad sign. I think everyone should pray for peace. Mexico's on fire in their forest near where the earthquakes were. And just think how much, you know, during the last two years and through to everything, no matter what has been happening, there's been a super hard sell of this brand new fancy off-world digital currency that they've been selling that is like, that is money, but it's like way better and more karmically clean than money. And all money is evil. I don't know, it's been weird. And inflation has been, you know, totally crazy and totally bad. But still, if you look at inflation levels, we haven't reached World War I inflation levels we haven't reached World War II inflation levels. In some places, they saw 25% inflation. And so, and, you know, civilization in America didn't collapse during those times. Yeah, having shit, you know, more expensive sucks. And talking about supply chain, the market dog was like last year, supply chain disruption where kids play. Welcome to supply disruption 2.0. Oh my God, this reminds me, Easter candy is going to be 50% off tomorrow. Peeps are good. Rodrigo Zidane ships waiting to unload in Shanghai who is ready for some old supply side inflation. There's a lot of ships waiting. Shanghai is the biggest city in China. 
It's just been locked down for like five, six weeks, I think. Um, you know, saying prayers to those people. Yeah. And America's still in like some weird, angry belief system, civil war between right and left. As your planetary defense commander, I try to stay in the middle. I mean, this above, the rise above. So it's been a good Easter for me here working and walking. And I hope you're having a great Easter. Things are crazy, though. Hey, I don't know, man. Maybe alien ships are hiding in the shelf clouds. This is from November 2021. Or they're in these lenticular clouds. Or segue to snow. And when the sun acts weird, earth weather acts weird, I act weird. And you know, didn't the Bible say, and Jesus say, the love of money is the root of all evil. And he kicked over a bunch of money changers tables. So, I don't know. It seems an important point. One hour later, well, this was 19 hours ago, but that is interesting activity. Tarnished Mikey is like, Ramsey's, I'm sorry, I diagnose you with Letma. And Ramsey's like, what's Letma? Let my people go. So I hope you have had a great day, and I would like to say thank you to you for being awesome. Staying cool, being amazing. Whatever the weather. Zip, zip. All right. Yeah, the world has changed a lot in the last hundred years. In many ways, it stays the same. And the world has definitely changed a lot in the last 2,000 years. Think of the impact, you know, whether people believe it or not. Jesus Christ has had on this world. You know, it's quite a jump from Jesus Christ to gasoline prices. What is that? 2,000, 20 years later. All right. Wow. Did you know they didn't have telescopes back in the year zero? At least that we know of. Do you think it's weird we canceled the space shuttle? Wait, there's another. Hey, y'all, wicked storm coming to the Northeast on Tuesday. All right, stay tuned. Keep it together. Okay. I'm going to go catch a bit of sunset. NFTs make me laugh. These are four billionaire NFTs that people can buy, I guess, for millions or billions of dollars. Each. Forbes expanding into the metaverse. Wow, the metaverse looks so much fun. <laughs> I was joking. I would rather play World of Warcraft. All right. Okay. So, you know, I hope you have a great night. I hope you have a great evening. And I hope things get better. Dr. Erica Palmario. Remember the duo ARs? Well, they're back. I think that's what she was going to say. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. And here we go. Oh. Yeah. That's some impressive imagery. All right, God bless everyone, and pretty please pray for peace. But this is America, so you're free to do whatever you want. Asterisk within limits. Okay, I'm being overwhelmed with feelings of joy. The energy's been really good today, in my opinion, in my impression, in my pers- from my perspective. And I'm showing you pretty pictures of pretty Easter colors, I think. And oh, the energy fields. And look, there's another one behind it. You know what? These almost look exactly like, so like, like there's, let's just say, is that Neptune? Ju- that would be Jupiter, Neptune, and Saturn. Notice how in that flying bee pattern? If you look over here, well, let's go to this one. Where like Earth's coming around the mountain and there's Saturn, Jupiter, and Neptune, big bodies in our heavens with um, angular planetary momentum. And so... You know, it's that it's almost like Jupiter, Neptune, and Saturn. 
see the, the same triangle. See what I'm saying? That triangle there being over, like the three ships, this would be the middle ship. It's right there. Bing, ding, ding. See? Neptune, Jupiter, and then Saturn. So that's just something interesting. An interesting pattern. Patterns and signs are everywhere. In the heavens and on Earth. Ooh, dude. And Easter candy's 50% off tomorrow. Houston, we have a problem. Yeah, there's been weird crime in Houston lately. Like, they found a dead body in a U-Haul. I know that's, you know, it's part of the cycle of life and death. I'm going to stay grateful to, that I'm alive and I have my health and I'm going to do the best I can with my life. I'm trying to make y'all laugh as many times as possible, if I can. Being funny is a, a, a weird thing in the modern age. Hey, Beetlejuice is now 115% of its usual brightness. That's always, that's been a story that's been fascinating me the last two or three years, for sure. Man, I talked about inflations and supply chains and the suns and the weathers, but I didn't talk about women. All right, scientists are talking about a possible prehistoric subterranean lake frozen on the surface of Greenland. Um, it's a very strange world right now, you know? There was also a destructive hailstorm in Florida earlier today. It was the best of times. It was the worst of times. It was the weirdest of times. And the U.S. Food and Drug Administration is investigating Lucky Charm cereal after dozens of customers complained of illness after eating it. Unlucky Charms? Oh, man. All right, so I'm trying to live with love and forgiveness and humor in my heart. And you do you. And for some people, that means they're going to hack old satellites. The Hill asks, with Elon as an example, shouldn't we change the L ability so Elon Musk can be president of the United States, even though he's born in um, Africa? Wait, is that irony? And I still think it's weird Satake Noshimoto, the creator of Bitcoin, is totally anonymous. Anywho, I hope you have a super duper wonderful, great night and have had a wonderful day. May God bless you, may you stay cool and awesome, and may peace rain down on earth and prosperity for all of us eventually or soon. God bless everyone. Stay cool. Happy Easter. Happy Resurrection Day. Happy He's Risen Day. God bless everyone.